Hello everyone, this is King Kong LT Lessons. This is lesson 6. I will show you the smart veil solution. I just select this, uh, this uh, veil, traditional veil. We can let it become smart. Uh, you can control by your mobile phone or by your PC software. Okay, let's begin. Before you design your project about the smart veil, you need to confirm which follow type uh, material is following in the pipe. Uh, maybe you have the word or you, you have the oil, or maybe you have the gas, or maybe the CO1 gas, or maybe uh, this is the liquid. So this is mainly two kinds of material of following the pipe. And the second, in the, to the country way, uh, there are two ways to country the well. Uh, one is for mechanic, and the two is the electric. Uh, what is the difference? I give see you some device. Uh, this is for mechanic, and this is for electric. Because this have a metal device, and this is two line for the power supply, and uh, this can install on the traditional valve, just like this, uh, fixed by the metal device. And uh, when this power is uh, give the power supply, then uh, the valve will turn left or turn right. So this is countering the traditional way uh, by the valve. And this is the electrical uh, country way. Uh, this is like a relay or this is a coin inside of the black body. So when these two lines have the power supply, then the uh, water or the oil can go through the input point, and this is the output, and will, like this, go through. And this, if there is no power, uh, it, it is disconnect. It is closed. Uh, you can see uh, this is country inside. This is country inside. At later, I will, I will power on for, for example for you. This is a mark. This is directions. So the oil or the water uh, is from this to this. So the mechanic way, just uh, use this. Uh, you can use the old valve, uh, not need to replace the old valve for the new. If you use the electrical valve, you need to replace uh, the old valve. So if you have uh, already have a valve, uh, use this way is easy. And if the well, it's broken. You just uh, replace this for a new one. Is okay. Uh, if you use this way, uh, you need to install uh, this electrical valve instead of the old one. So if you, this is broken, uh, it's uh, difficult to replace this one. Okay, this is two kinds of the country way, and we can see the three is the power supply for the uh, device. Uh, maybe you have. DC 12 voltage, or DC 24 voltage, or AC 110 voltage, or AC 220 voltage. And this is a different voltage uh, you can choose, uh, like this electrical. Uh, this has many different power supply. But I think if you use the gas, because it's dangerous for the high voltage, so you'd better choose the, the, low, the low voltage is better, is safety. Uh, if you really can't, uh, maybe some valve is very big, so it needs more, more power to drive the valve. So maybe we have the AC220 voltage. But if you can choose the low voltage, just uh, choose low voltage is better, not choose the high voltage. And the output, uh, because uh, this valve has the output uh, different types, uh, it's normal open and the normal close, just NO and NC. So uh, that means, normal open means, uh, when there is no power on, then the water can follow, can go through the valve. The normal close, that means, when the line is no power, the follow can't, is stopped, uh, can't go through the valve. So you can choose uh, which 
which situation is usually used? Uh, maybe the value is usually uh, let the word go through. So you can choose normal open. And maybe just sometimes, very rarely times to let the uh, value power on. So you can choose the normal close. Because long time for the power, for the value. Because if the verb work for a long time, it will become hot. So uh, for the safety, uh, you can choose the right type of the output uh, for the valve. And the four, uh, hot, open, and close the valve, uh, we'll, we will have an experiment uh, to show you uh, the valve give the power voltage, uh, what will be happened. OK, let's look at this some different type of the wheel. Uh, this is mechanical way. Uh, just uh, you can see this is appearance. And this is the 12 voltage power supply uh, we have installed on the pipe. And this electric type, uh, you can see uh, this two line. And this is mark uh, input. And this is follow out follow output. And you can see uh, the voltage and uh, what others. This is voltage and uh, pressure and the temperature and the size like this. And this is for the gas. Also have the direction mark and the input. And this is output. Also you can see the voltage input. This is gas. OK, this we have installed. Now we can let this two line power on. We can see what will happen. And because the device have coin, uh, so we can use a large power. Now I have used this power supply. The 12 voltage is 4 ampere. I think at least you need to use a 2 ampere uh, for this one and for this one. OK, now we can give this two line power supply DC 12 watts. You can see the power on. Now it's turn right. And it will auto stop. Uh, if you have not stopped the power, it also will stop. So now I want to this way change another directions. I just like this one connect to this place and this red one and change the polo. Now you change directions. We can see inside of the hole. You can see what will inside. Okay, you can see the word will not follow. And which this time we change. We change the point, and now we power on. You can see this is changed. Okay, so that uh, the word or the I will be go follow. This is uh, well, how it works. Okay, now let's look at the electrical void. How, how it works. We can also give this two power supply just the power on. And this is spark. I turn off my light. Now you can see the spark clearly. So the momentary current is large. Now I will ready to power on. Uh, make sure you can see clearly. You can see inside of the pipe. You can see this place. Uh, this is a coin to country. Close and open. Just inside. OK, this is the principle of this electrical device. Now, if you want to make a project about the smart valve, uh, 
uh, you need how to choose the valve. You just according to one, uh, the follow type, and the country way, and the power voltage, and the output type. Uh, one, two, three, you can design, and you can confirm which type of the device, electric device you needed. Okay, let's look at the principle, uh, how to open and close the valve. If you use this electric valve, that will be very easy. Just like this valve, uh, just give this two points, uh, give the power, uh, then it will be open and close. So it can change just give power or not give the power. If you choose uh, this mechanical way, just like this, uh, because uh, it also have two power lines. This time, you can change the directions uh, for the metal device, just turn left or turn right. So you can use this to change directions. Just change this Apollo of the wire to change the directions. How to change? Uh, we can see the principle. This is device uh, just like this. This is this device. Uh, have two lines. We will use the relay one and the relay two. Just the two relay to country this well to uh, change the directions. Uh, maybe open and maybe the close. Uh, for example, this is DC 12 watch. Also, this is DC 12 watch. When this this relay is on and this this current is go to this and go through and this time the relay 2 is at this position so the current will be go to this way and this maybe you can uh, open open the valve and uh, Another situation, now the relay one is at this place and the relay two is at this place. So this time the current, the current will go through to this place. So at this situation will close close the valve. So we can use two relay to exchange the 12 voltage and the ground. So that we can let it become open and become close. So this is this is a way to exchange the polo. Okay when you understand the principle how to change the polo for changing the directions uh, you can see the five is a diagram. Uh, this is uh, for the electric valve. So this is the easy way. I just uh, give the 12 volt DC and uh, to the relay and uh, go through the valve and uh, go to the ground. So this can use any relay controller. HX means this, this X means different channel. So all channel module can be used in this situation. I uh, just use COM and and oh normal open and the comp can control the value just uh, go through or not go through uh, by this diagram if you use uh, this mechanical way uh, we can like this diagram you can choose uh, case 868 uh, uh, 2 4 8 uh, 16 channel uh, why not use the 32 channel? Because the 32 channel is without the normal close point. Uh, this is not enough space to install so many points. So we can uh, choose any of this module. So we can like uh, relay 1 and relay 2, just like this diagram. Uh, this is relay 1, relay 2. So we can let the DC 12 watch uh, in, and this is a COM and connect with the valve. And also we can connect the ground uh, with the NC, ground with the NC, and the DC-12 uh, with the normal open, and the DC-12 with the normal open. The COM, uh, these two COM points all connect with the 
valve. So this can country the relay one on and the relay one and relay two off. Uh, so you can uh, let this valve open and you can use the relay one off and the relay two on. So the valve will be closed. So this is some kinds of valve and the country way and the power and the output used for the relay controller to country different valve. Uh, for the solution. Okay, this is the uh, principle of the valve, how to country uh, open and close, and how to choose uh, by this effect. And you can also make the diagram to country the valve, uh, become smart. Okay, thanks for watching. See you next lesson.